CBS's Steve Hartman ends the week with a story of true love shining through the darkest of times. Here is tonight's On the Road. Oh my gosh, let's find the picture. Peter and Lisa Marshall of Andover, Connecticut are paging through the most memorable day of their lives. It looked like a lovely wedding. It was. It was unforgettable. <laughs> but he's forgotten it. He has forgotten it. Who's this? It's the saddest part yeah. because you want to reminisce and you're alone in the memory. Red Wing Blackbird. Three years ago, at the age of 53, Peter was diagnosed with early onset Alzheimer's. Eventually, he not only forgot his wedding day. He's pretty, isn't he? He forgot his wife. Lisa became just another nameless caretaker. Their entire history together permanently erased. And yet, a whisper of their love must have remained, because Lisa says all of a sudden, he began courting her, as if they'd just started dating. Until one day, a wedding scene came on TV. Peter pointed to the screen and said, let's do it. And I said, do what? And he pointed, at the, he pointed again, and I said, you want to get married? And he got this grin on his face, and he said, yeah. So he fell in love with me again. <laughs> Lisa accepted his proposal, and a few months ago, she staged a wedding for her already husband. I can't even describe to you how magical it was. How are you? He was so present, <laughs> and he was so happy, yeah. and it was very touching. Peter, you may kiss your bride. Lisa says Peter hadn't been this lucid in weeks. <laughs> Unfortunately, it was a Cinderella moment. The clock struck 12, and by the next morning, this wedding too was lost to the fog. Yes. But Lisa says she fully expected that. I'm the one who's gonna remember that and that's gonna help me heal later because it really is a true love story. Alzheimer's can take away so much, but fortunately, love is almost always the last to go. Steve Hartman, On the Road in Andover, Connecticut.